probably know this, but when a writer shares information on a topic, like if it's bears or tigers with his reader, he uses pictures and words, right? Yeah. To teach us something. And yeah, you do it all the time. He has a point he wants you to remember. And your teachers probably told you that. Like, what does the author want me to remember? The point is what he wants to remember. So one way to figure out the writer's point is to ask some questions. And I can already tell you guys are good at that. You're good at asking questions. OK, so this is the work that we're going to do today. And I'm going to do it first, and you're going to get to do it next, OK? So we are going to ask questions to find the key point the author wants us to know looking at pictures. All right? So this is what we're going to do. We're going to say this. We're going to say, what is the topic? You guys say that with me. What is the topic? Do you see it there? What is the topic? And then we're going to say, what are the details? Say that with me. What are the details? And then we're going to say, what do the details tell me? You say it. What do the details tell me? And that's going to be the point. So this is what we want to know. What is the point? Show me the point. Excellent. Excellent. OK, so here we go. Here are some pictures. Hmm. Oh, I love the way you're studying these. OK, with me. All right, so what is the topic? All of those pictures, what seems to be in every single picture that I'm studying up there? What is the topic? The topic is bears. bears. Exactly. So what are the details? Well, Pooh is jumping on a log to get Piglet up to honey. Pooh is trying to get honey. This bear on the end has got his eyes stuck in a honey jar. He wants the honey so bad. This bear is climbing up to the honey pod to get it. Winnie the Pooh, even though he's not even a real bear, he's taking this balloon up to get honey. That bear on the very end, he is, oh my goodness, he's eating honey right out of the jar from a human. Okay, so. I'm thinking the topic, the topic, do the gesture with me. The topic is bears. The details are that bears will do anything to get honey. So what does the author want me to remember? What's the point? Bears like honey and will do anything to get them. Do you see how I did that? What is the topic? What are the details? The bears trying to get the honey. What do the details make me think? That bears will do anything to get honey. Okay, do you see how I did that? Okay, it's your turn. Okay. So here are our tiger pictures. All right, so take a look up there. And I want you to be thinking in your head. We'll do, I'll do the gesture and you do the thinking work. Okay, you looking at me? Here we go. What is the topic? You got it in your head? Tiger. Look at the pictures. What are the details? Are you looking? Look at the details. What do the details make me think about tigers? What is the point? I'm going to count to three, and I want you to turn and talk with your partner. And you can use the gestures if you want. Tell them what the topic, the details, and the point. Okay, one, two, three, go. Okay. What were some details that you saw? Jumping on the stairs. And the tiger 
Uncle's the toy. There's two tigers fighting. Uh, then was the tiger running with Winnie the Pooh on his tail? What are you thinking? So what's the point? Okay, so one is jumping and I'm trying to do something like this. Okay, back to me, you guys. All right, I want you to wiggle your fingers in the air if this, wait, I didn't even say it. If you said the topic, the topic was tigers. I see it. You said it, I heard you say it. The topic was tigers. Oh my goodness, listen to this. Did you guys say something like this? Like the tiger's playing on the ball. Tigger is jumping on his tail. The tiger is playing with the stuffed animal. The tiger is jumping. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. And so Stella said, all of this, all of these details made me think the author wants me to know that tigers are playful. Sound familiar? We said that. Oh my goodness, you guys are so smart. Yeah, yeah. good thinking.